Queen Elizabeth-class aircraft carriers are often underestimated, yet they represent a leap in naval power through their amazing capability. These 65,000-ton vessels are the largest warships ever built for the Royal Navy, equipped to deploy up to 40 F-35B stealth fighters and Merlin helicopters for missions ranging from precision strikes to anti-submarine warfare. Their 280-meter flight deck Featuring a ski jump ramp for short takeoff and vertical landing operations, enables rapid aircraft deployment without requiring catapults. Beyond their size, the carrier's integrated electric propulsion system sets them apart. Using diesel generators and gas turbines, this system improves fuel efficiency, reduces acoustic signatures for stealth, and provides the power needed for advanced radar and weapon systems. What makes this carrier so different from others is the Twin Islands. The Twin Island design, a first for modern carriers, separates navigation and flight control functions, minimizing air turbulence over the deck and improving operational redundancy. This configuration also distributes critical systems across the ship, enhancing survivability during combat. The Queen Elizabeth class boasts an unparalleled sortie generation rate, capable of launching 72 fast jet sorties daily, with surge capacity exceeding 110 missions in high-intensity scenarios. This surpasses the output of many larger carriers, thanks to streamlined deck operations and automated ammunition handling systems. Advanced sensors like the Artisan 3D radar track up to 1,000 targets simultaneously, while the Samson radar provides ballistic missile defense enabling the carriers to dominate air and sea battle spaces. Defensively, the carriers are fortified with Phalanx CWEs, 30mm automated guns, and layered electronic warfare suites to counter missiles, drones, and surface threats. Their distributed power systems and compartmentalized machinery spaces reduce vulnerability to critical damage, ensuring operational continuity even under attack. Additionally, their modular design allows for rapid integration of future technologies, such as unmanned aerial systems or directed energy weapons. Strategically, these carriers project global influence far beyond raw firepower. They serve as mobile command centers for joint forces, support humanitarian missions, and act as symbols of diplomatic strength. With a range of 10,000 nautical miles and the ability to sustain 1,600 personnel for 45 days, the Queen Elizabeth class redefines naval power by blending cutting-edge warfare capabilities with peacetime adaptability. What do you think? <laughs>